Have you ever noticed how a certain smell, sound or sight can instantly transport you back to a specific moment in time? Remember that song that always makes you smile, or the scent of freshly baked cookies that evokes warm memories of childhood? These are natural anchors at work. In NLP, we use anchors consciously. An anchor is any stimulus, a touch, word, sound, smell or image that triggers a specific emotional or mental state. Like a ship's anchor secures it to a spot, NLP anchors lock in desired states. This can be incredibly powerful for personal change and therapeutic interventions. Imagine having access to a resource state at any given moment. Anchoring allows us to do just that. It empowers us to choose how we want to feel and respond to life's challenges. By mastering the art of anchoring, we gain control over our emotional states. We can then access these states whenever we need them. This essay will guide you through the process of installing, using and collapsing anchors. You'll learn how to create positive anchors for yourself and your clients. You'll also discover how to break free from limiting patterns by collapsing negative anchors. Think of your brain as a vast network of interconnected pathways. Each pathway represents a specific thought, feeling or behaviour. Every time you experience something, you create or strengthen a pathway. Now imagine attaching a brightly coloured ribbon to a specific pathway. This ribbon is your anchor. Anytime you want to access that specific thought, feeling or behaviour, you simply pull on the ribbon. The act of pulling the ribbon is the process of triggering your preset anchor. Anchors are created through association. When you experience a strong emotional or mental state, you can anchor it to a specific stimulus. This stimulus can be anything that you can easily access later. The key to effective anchoring is timing. The anchor must be set at the peak of the experience when the state is most intense. This ensures a strong and reliable association. Once set, anchors can be fired off at will to re-experience the anchored state. This makes anchoring an incredibly versatile tool for personal growth and therapeutic change. Installing an anchor is a simple yet precise process. Follow these steps to create powerful anchors for yourself and others. First, identify the desired state you want to anchor. It could be anything from confidence and joy to calmness and focus. Once you know the state, help yourself or your client access it. Use your NLP skills. Guide them to vividly recall a time when they felt that state intensely. As they relive the experience, help them amplify the desired state. Encourage them to make the memory brighter, louder and more vivid. Ask questions that deepen their experience. What are you seeing? What are you hearing? What are you feeling? At the peak of the experience, when the state is most intense, set the anchor. This could be a touch on the hand, a specific word or phrase, or even a gesture. The anchor should be unique, consistent, and easily repeatable. After setting the anchor, break the state. Distract them for a moment and then fire off the anchor. Observe their response. Did they access the anchored state? If so, your anchor is set. If not, repeat the process, ensuring the anchor is set at the peak of the experience. Eliciting powerful states is crucial for effective anchoring. The stronger the initial state, the more powerful the anchor. Use a variety of techniques to help your clients access and amplify their desired states. Ask your clients to close their eyes and vividly imagine a time when they felt the desired state. Encourage them to see, hear, feel and even smell the experience as if they were there again. Help your clients connect with the physical sensations associated with the desired state. Ask them to pay attention to how their body feels. Where do they feel the sensation? What is the quality of the sensation? Use music, nature sounds or even your own voice to evoke the desired state. Pay attention to the tone, tempo and volume of your voice. Certain sounds can have a profound impact on our emotional states. Use metaphors and stories to indirectly access the desired state. Stories bypass conscious resistance and tap into the unconscious mind. Brought to you by actionfactory.co.za.